All right, so I bought myself a new guitar because I want to play in drop B. So I had to go out and buy myself a 25.5 scale length neck because apparently a lot of drop B guitarists play with that scale length though. So I got myself the uh, Mark Holcomb. There she is, Mark Holcomb signature PRS. Look at that. Look, look at the birds. And then look, the last one is a dugon or a turtle just swimming with the birds. There she is. So yeah, looks a bit different compared to the other PRS models. I'm not much of a good guitarist, but I like making music, so I'll give you a run through of how it sounds. Let's go. Oh yeah, I'm using the Amp Roots by the way, Fluff, the Friedman Amp. So I'll, I'll press record and off we go. So these thick strings, but I need to get you some. So just to uh, let know, that guitar I was playing, um, it's, uh, it's good man, like the way it sits when I'm playing with a strap on it, you know, it, with some guitars they're real thick in the body where I feel like I kind of have to roll my shoulder forward 
to be able to play it and it hurts. Like I got some weird, I don't know, some shoulder problem where if I roll my shoulder forward too much it just hurts and it strains my shoulder a bit. But this guitar, man, it just sits so well. The body's like, I don't know, the way the body is, it's just thin in a certain way where I, I just roll my shoulder back properly on a good posture and I can play it properly. I don't have to hump my shoulder over. And um, yeah, it's just... It's good to play, man. Like, it's a good guitar. But hey, everyone's different. Everyone has different problems. But I'm going to say, like, I bought this guitar to play in drop B. And apparently this guitar is set to drop C. This is weird. Like, when I bought this guitar, by the way, I bought it off the internet. It came from a store. So it came through shipping. When I got it, it was already in drop B. Like literally and everything feels good. Like I didn't have to put new strings on it as well. Like, you know, you get a new guitar, you have to put new strings on it because the strings just sound terrible. This, I don't know what happened to it, but either the shopkeeper put new strings on it or it just came like that in stock. But it sounds awesome. Like I don't even have to put new strings on it or adjust anything. It was already adjusted to drop B. I just had to tweak the tuning a bit. So yeah, awesome guitar, man. Like, <laughs> it's set up already. Yeah. Um, I know if it was Mark Holcomb, good on you, bro, because you made an awesome guitar and I love it. Thanks.